This year, Radiant Healthcare Centers introduced the Beacon of Hope Award to recognize a person or group that embodies the spirit and resilience of the LGBTQ plus community in Orange County. Allison, Tony, and I are thrilled to present the Beacon of Hope Award to Jules Ricana. Jules is a junior at the Orange County School of the Arts, also known as OSHA. OSHA in the house. And if I could go off script just for a moment, I know Taryn is here, President and CEO of OSHA. We had a moment in the chat earlier. The programs and, and the space you create is, is and will save lives. So thank you for the work you all are doing there at OSHA. Thank you. So back to Jules. After four years in the musical theater conservatory, Jules transferred to the popular music conservatory this school year. Jules, who performs with Montage, OSHA's distinguished group of performance ambassadors, has shared the stage with renowned figures from Broadway, TV, and a little place you might know as Disney. <laughs> Jules' journey to live his truth represents the struggles of so many young people in our LGBTQ plus community. He faced significant challenges, particularly during the pandemic, struggling with his gender identity. And it was a dark time. And Jules' uh, journey required him to be homeschooled for a semester during uh, that time. However, Jules is back at, uh, was back at campus uh, for his sophomore year. However, Jules was fortunate enough to have a remarkable group of people rally behind him. With the support of his amazing and compassionate special service team at school, his parents, his family, the montage team, teachers, and OSHA at large, Jules found the strength to recover and be confident in his transgender identity. Now he's performing again, proudly alongside his sister, Ava Grace, in Montage, whom we will see a little more of later tonight. Today, Jules maintains a cumulative <clears throat> 4.6 academic GPA. 4.6 overachiever and is semi-finalist. I didn't have a 4.6. And is a semi finalist for the Orange County Artist of the Year in Voice yes. with the Orange County Register. And stay tuned because the winner is going to be published in the Sunday paper at the end of this month. Jules proudly represents the LGBTQ plus and neurodivergent communities. Through his resilience and activism, Jules challenges stigma surrounding mental health by sharing his journey. Please join us in extending our heartfelt congratulations to the recipient of the 2024 Beacon of Hope Award, Jules Ricana. that I was going to get an award for resilience, I would not have believed you at all. There was a time where I didn't think I was gonna get past my 15th birthday. I felt so hopeless. And during my journey, I met so many other kids who were going through worse. I'm the lucky one. With the help of supportive healthcare, my school, my family, and organizations like Radiant who speak to the struggles of the LGBTQ, I made it to 17, I just got my driver's license, <laughs> and I'm standing here doing what I love, and that is to perform on stage. I want to give a shout out and a huge thank you to my school, the Orange County School of the Arts. <laughs> the president, Mr. Taryn Schaefer, who is here tonight. <laughs> thank you for running. It's such an amazing school that embraces kids like me. 
I also want to thank my academic counselor, Ms. Kaus, and OSHA's special services team, namely Mr. Graves, for her support on hard days. This OSHA team changes and saves lives every day. And I'm always amazed to see how much they all care about their students. To montage! Ms. Pekka, Ms. Wackerman, Ms. Quinn Oleshik, and Mr. Jacob Theotoni, and more, who gave opportunities to students like me to not only follow our dreams and perform, but to let us present the way we identify on stage. Thank you for giving me the chance to do what I love. And montage, uh, during the really hard times, montage was what I looked forward to every day. And lastly, to my parents, my dad, Julian, who is my safe base, and my mom, Alexis, who is my biggest advocate, especially my mom. She never stops fighting and advocating for me. If it wasn't for her, I wouldn't be pushed to achieve my biggest wins. So I accept this award on behalf of all of you who believed in me. Lastly, I would like to thank all of you here tonight in attendance for supporting an organization like Radiant Health. Because of your allyship, I stand here tonight representing what an LGBTQ plus neurodivergent teen can do when given the resources and support we need to thrive. Thank you. I can't wait to perform later. <laughs> Welcome to the stage, Broadway star and the 2023 Radiant Compassion Award honoree, Javier Muniz. Good evening, everyone. This is a beautiful night, isn't it? 